Hello, hello, hello everyone and welcome to my reaction to Chainsaw Man episode 4. As you can see, I'm in the new studio. Yesterday was my first video, but maybe some of you um, will be seeing it for the first time today. So yeah, I was able to put up a shelf today so I can finally display some of my gifts that you guys have sent me. Um, most of these figures have all been gifts and then uh, these are my Pokemon teddies and Chopper also a gift and they have a little Caterpie and a Pokeball and I love my manga um, but not all of it but a lot of it down there uh, probably won't get to display all my manga um, but eventually I can probably maybe make like a shelf there that at least for me I can see it <laughs> uh, yeah and I still need to finish the manga wall at the bottom here um, and hopefully a cat will pop by later to use the cat tree and yeah there's still a few things I want to do in the studio like paint the closets um, and then put my mirror there and the rug and the curtains um, I'm having a trouble finding a purple or lilac curtains so yeah slowly but surely everything is working out um, tomorrow I will be streaming on Twitch for the first time in the new studio um, starting at 4.30 p.m. South African Standard Time so please take a look at my description if you want to join me on Twitch I will be watching uh, reacting to Mob Psycho and then um, playing games let me just see here Mob Psycho oh today tomorrow is Attack on Titan manga read along um, but usually uh, Wednesdays will be a gaming stream and on the 18th Pokemon Violet is coming out so I will probably play that on Wednesdays after it comes out um, so yeah please take a look at my streams if you're keen but other than that thank you so much for being here today I hope you will enjoy my reaction let's get started I just hope there won't be buffering today. I did try and pre-download, but um, fiber will only be in hopefully tomorrow. They said they were gonna come today if it didn't rain. It didn't rain, they didn't come. <laughs> but let's hope that they'll come early tomorrow. That'll be real nice so that I can do my first stream with fiber. Um, otherwise, I'm really worried about you know bad quality internet won't work with streaming so I might have to postpone but let's hope it, it that won't come to that okay let's go I'm not judging I just had a chicken mayo sandwich I think a little part of it is also because he uh, would have done the same maybe for Pochita or he would have wanted to. I don't know if he would have literally done it. He's, she's a demon. She doesn't care about human life. So I'm not sure how he would have felt, but at least he could relate to her before about, you know, wanting to save Pochita. Oh. 
Another one? Oh, and that looks like a worm one. Before we get started with the episode, I wanted to say, I think a very important theme in the show that I'm noticing so far, but if I'm wrong, if this isn't an important theme, if you're a manga reader, you know, this is just my own interpretation, but it seems to me like a very, like, a, a golden thread or something that's going to be prevalent, um, especially in the, in the characters' motivations, is... You know the warmth that you get from being with people, uh, like being with a friend, being with a girlfriend, your mom's hug, or um, like that seems to be a very important theme with her and the cat and with, with uh, Denji and his wanting to fondle breasts. Like to me, all of that is just a desire to be intimate with someone else uh, which is very like obviously Denji hasn't really spent any time with any people like he grew up as a child by himself he doesn't really know how to properly um, express that desire so for him it's like boobs also he's what 16 17 it's normal <laughs> um, I mean even me <laughs> I think boobs are pretty nice. <laughs> um, so my point is just that I think that's an important theme. It's just intimacy with others. Like that part, because I think as human beings, we can't survive completely by ourselves. I know that some people are more introverted, so they need alone time to recharge. Um, but to some extent, everyone needs companionship and everyone needs to be close to others. Um, so yeah, I like that theme, I find it interesting. There's some boobs for you. <laughs> Choreography. So good. with his own intestines.
Oh, he's gonna have to be saved. <gasps> what if she... Okay, so another maybe theme linked to the other theme. It could be like, okay, first of all, the show is very wild. So, in a really wild way, it's kind of, uh, I think maybe addressing the, you know, because how many a shonen it's about it, the 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 it's these great dreams right like i want to be the pirate king i want to be the hokage da, 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 da. and you know all these kids grow up watching these uh great anime characters want to achieve these great things and the, do whatever it takes but not everyone has these like you know, I don't, I don't necessarily want a million subscribers and um, I don't want to be like a billionaire and all this kind of stuff. Um, I just, I would just love to be able to keep doing what I'm doing and have fun doing it and have like two or three kids and uh, be with someone I love and, uh, you know, just normal. I know being a YouTuber isn't normal already, but like, it's kind of an extreme way giving us a message that small dreams are, are fine to have. Wanting to fondle boobs is a, is a good enough dream. Like wanting to be with someone whose boobs you can fondle forever is not a bad dream. If that's your dream, that's okay too. Am I, am I, am I reading too much into it? But this too seems to me that's what makes this show different and Denji different from like other MCs. <laughs> ah, he definitely is not as crude about it, but he also won't want to touch her boobs. Looks good with his hair down. See, even me, a sexual beast. See him with his hair down, suddenly thinking stuff. We're all beasts. <laughs> Yari. パワーちゃんに貸してほしいの。なんで俺の家にやばい奴ばかり集めるんですか。私が早川君を一番に信用しているからだよ。うん。はい。ああ。気に食わせるのも私ね。入れ。せんだよ。はいちゃん。人間は
I love it. <laughs> so good so good almost I saw zero and I thought was it not recording but that's something else okay score time score time score time okay so man episode four so <coughs> <clears throat> During the um, Denji versus Leech Devil fight, um, the visuals visuals were not as good as before, or maybe I just noticed it this time and I didn't notice it last time. I don't know. But oh wait, let me just unfade the screen here. But it wasn't like a lot worse. It's just that and the choreography. Like the running and the spinning and the fighting, the choreography itself was amazing. It's just that some parts seemed like it had a little less, less frames than usual. Um, it was men in the part with when he was like screaming at the devil, blah 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 blah. blah. But it also it gives a similar like it 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 adds to the feel of you know watching a map anime so it's not like a big issue for me or anything and it's just that one part everything else was really really great um and i love the style of the anime and i love like the colors and that also fits the mood of like a mappa anime so the story for this um i mean i can't really fault the story in any way i think the pacing is perfect I think the themes that I at least am interpreting are really well expressed. My, I don't know, I can't really fault it. But at the same time, I'm trying to be like strict and not too lenient and not too biased, but it's very difficult. So I'm going to give this a 9.5 for a story, a 10 for a character, no, a 9.5 for characters. Um, a. An 8.5 to 9 for visuals. I'm going to have the 8.8 8 for visuals. A 9 for audio and a 9 for enjoyment. 9.5 for enjoyment. Uh, no, yes, that's, that's perfect. I really like the show, I really like the characters, I really like like how they're like, like, <laughs> I really like how they're a uh, little family now <laughs> and he's like the parent and he'll take care of them and the way that Denji and the powers dynamic and I love that they have a cat <sighs> I mean I'm obviously biased for that I just had a lot of fun with the episode and I don't know everything about it is engaging and interesting and fun my favorite part is the fact that power moved in and had brought the cat and the uh, She's the pen she, uh, scene. That was like maybe my favorite part. But I also really liked the, the theme of like small dreams are good dreams too. I love that. And then my least favorite part was just that one part where he was screaming at the devil. Like just the lack of a few frames there. And his expression in one part when I know it was meant to look like way out there and, it, and they really conveyed how kind of unhinged he, he can be and can get. I mean, after everything he's been through, it's understandable. Um, but just his one expression during that, that one part, I, I didn't really like the... the they, in that part, I didn't feel like there was depth. It felt a little bit odd. And yeah. 
and and then the shouting part that looked a little bit like it was lacking some frames but i mean that's just my favorite and my least favorite parts of the episode other than those small parts that i didn't those two two scenes that i didn't like two little visual things everything else was perfect and yeah overall 9.3 for the episode from me um let me know what you guys think and i'll see you next week bye